Hi everyone, uh, just a short video to uh, show you my Yamaha V-Star 650. It's a 2009 model and I brought it new out of the crate in 2011. I'm the only owner of this bike and have uh, loved it. I've absolutely enjoyed this bike. It's actually uh, difficult for me to even contemplate getting rid of it or to sell it, but it's actually, uh, it's actually just a fantastic machine. Um, there's been a number of things that I've done to it. Um, at the moment it only has uh, 10,000 kilometers on it. For those of you that are in the US, that's a roughly 6,000 miles. Um, and it, uh, I've done some significant modifications to it, um, but really basic ones, ones that could be turned back if you didn't want the bike modified. The key one being the hypercharger, which is absolutely fantastic. Rejetting of the carbs and the combination of those things really gives it more power. Power, um, as well as uh, modification of the stock exhaust so the, it breathes a lot better, it gets more fuel, it gets more air and it just runs a lot better. So this thing, if you've ridden a V-Star 650 before, trust me, this thing uh, would blow a stock machine away. This thing really puts out some serious power. So um, as you can see, the bike is in really, really excellent shape. There's nothing wrong with it. It's never been dropped. Uh, it does come with saddlebags. Oh, I see I don't have my, I don't have my buckle on the outside of that bag, forgive me, but uh, uh, in any event, uh, let's give it a start up here. So I'm just gonna pull the choke. So the choke is right down here, pull the choke. Oh, where is it? Ah, oh, gee whiz, I'm losing it here. Okay, so pull the choke, and uh, now let me just put my hand on the, on the exhaust so you know that it is stone, stone cold, okay? Absolutely stone cold. Not been started at all. I haven't started it in probably a week, so uh, yeah, let's give her a go here. So we'll just turn the key on. Okay, got her on there, and let's uh, just give her a go. There she goes. As you can see, it's got a really nice uh, exhaust note. Really nice exhaust. And uh, yeah, I think we can probably, it's a warm day, so I think we can probably turn that choke off now. Yeah, awesome. And let's just come around here and I'll show you the hypercharger in action. So, there's our hypercharger, okay. So as you can see, she is, uh, she just goes and she really wants to go, let me tell you. So anyways, um, uh, this machine does come with a, uh, uh, a, a true Yamaha uh, windscreen. I have it off at the moment, but anyone that wants to go and put the a windscreen on it, I've got the bracket right here and it, she just bolts right up. You can put that windscreen back on. Uh, and again, it's a proper Yamaha one. It's not an aftermarket one. It's the proper uh, proper uh, windscreen for this bike. So if anybody wants a windscreen on it, that's ideal. For those that know these bikes, it's got a really, really nice low seat height. Uh, I am only about five foot seven myself, and I have zero trouble operating this bike. But I've had lots of buddies that are six foot two or or more that have also uh, taken my bike for a ride here and quite enjoyed it. So this bike is great for everybody uh, and is very stable to ride. So anyways, um, yeah, so that's it. This thing's, I'm gonna be putting it up for sale. And uh, uh, if anyone's interested in it, please do give me a call. Let's, uh, let's end the video with one more look at that hypercharger and, uh, and then a little bit of a listen to the bike. So here's our key, here's our hypercharger. Yeah. Okay guys, that's it for this one. Hey guys, one of the things that I forgot to mention in the past video uh, is, and it's an important thing, is that I've actually got uh, a Mustang seat on this. Mustang seat and the, uh, what do they call it, the pin pillion or something? The, you know, if you want to do double up uh, seat as well. And let me tell you, it is crazy comfortable. The other thing is really nice that I really like is essentially the style of this Mustang seat here essentially gives you a backrest here. So you're sitting here and it just holds you in the bike so you feel very very secure when you're riding it especially for 
you know, a new rider, but even just, you know, an older guy like me that uh, just wants comfort, this bike is ridiculously comfortable because of that Mustang seat. So just wanted to uh, to point that out to you. Uh, yeah, let's just uh, take a look there. Yeah, it's uh, it's absolutely uh, super, super good. So anyways, just uh, sorry, apologies. I, uh, I missed adding that to the first cut of this video, but uh, hopefully that gives you a little bit more information about it. Hope everybody's having a great day, enjoying the awesome weather, and uh, hey, bye for now.